Hi, and welcome to EMS Online. My name is Aggie. I'm going to guide you through this course, which is all about Agrium's Environment, Health, Safety, and Security Management System, commonly known as EMS. Our planning process defines how and when things will be done, communicated, monitored, and measured. Operational controls are developed during the planning process. Let's take a closer look. There are four basic steps in the planning process. Click through the steps in order. In the first planning step, we identify all aspects of our activities, operations, products, and services that could potentially impact the environment, workers, or the public. It's important to understand the risks so we can manage them effectively. Here are some examples of Agrium's high potential risks. Once we identify the risks, we determine what laws, regulations, industry standards, and stakeholder expectations apply to those risks. In the third planning step, we set our objectives for improving ehs and s performance using legal requirements as our minimum standard. Finally, we establish system requirements and management programs for achieving our objectives. Great work. Let's move from fundamentals to the planning process. There are nine environmental management standards. Click on each one for a quick pop-up explanation. Once you've gone through them all, you can move on. Continuous improvement in environmental performance is necessary for long-term business viability. To achieve this goal, a system is established to identify, evaluate, and control potential or actual impacts of wholesale operations on the community and the environment.